Hello and welcome to the Marion County Sheriff's Office Newsroom. I'm Deputy Paul Bloom. And I'm Lauren Latelier here with your daily crime report, first at five. Well, first of all, we had someone entered a vehicle parked at a home in the 100 block of Almond Road. Once inside, they stole a wallet and a cell phone with a total value of $110. They also caused $250 of damage to the vehicle's tire and door. A red Schwinn scooter was stolen from a home on Jupiter Pass Way. Total loss there is $1,000. Wow. All right. Mm. Someone broke into a home in the 1800 block of Southwest 60th Street. Once inside, they stole a laptop and a 40-inch television for a total loss of $480. Well, Deputy Batts observed a four-wheeler driven by Stephen Mattingly traveling on a roadway near Sunset Harbor Road and Timicon Road. Upon seeing law enforcement, Mattingly sped off. Deputy Batts attempted a traffic stop, but Mattingly failed to stop and a pursuit was initiated. And after a few minutes, Mattingly pulled into a yard on Southeast 103rd Avenue and fled on foot into the home. After a short time, he came out and was placed under arrest. A wallet with methamphetamine, marijuana, and drug paraphernalia was located near the four-wheeler he was driving. And Madeline's license was habitually suspended. He was arrested and transported to the Gold Star Hotel. All right. Well, that is all for today. And don't forget to join us tonight for our town hall meeting at the Village View Church we'll at 6 p.m. Mm -hmm. Both of all us right. will be there, so yes. come see us. <laughs> come out and see us. Please like us and share us on Facebook, and we'll see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching.